Oh, Jerry the Predator. I like it. I like That's it a lot. really just a Gotham City like building. Yeah, but the promo art for Predator Two had him on gargoyles and shit. But you know, you could say that that was. Perched. Oh man, did I ever tell you about that guy that has the cape? That used to live near me. I think you. Oh my this god, before. this guy was the best. Don't trust people with capes. Dude, he would walk around town in a cape, and it was, like, black on the outside and, like, purple on the inside. It was, like, one of those sleek, like, count capes. That's pretty awesome. With the brooch on the middle and everything. And, like, when he turned a corner, he'd draw it up against him and, like, swoosh it with every turn. And then just sit on the bus with his cape. And, like, one time... He was waiting for his girlfriend near, and you're uh, oh my god that's the worst gangbanger I've ever seen that's pretty fucking awful he was waiting for his girlfriend at, at, at a nearby college and like in the parking lot they had those giant cinder blocks I can't find thankfully they left me all these predator weapons giant cinder blocks so you walk by and all you see is this guy perched like a, like the predator on a cinder block with his hands out, one hand out, and one hand, like, on his Shut hip. Shut up! On the cinder block, and the cape <laughs> is blowing in the wind. Shut up! It was epic. I don't believe you. It was the most epic That's thing. That's too cool. I don't believe you. This guy just didn't give a fuck. Not a single fuck was given that day. They, they don't actually know where I am. That's cool. Oh, God, this is, like, a little twitchy. Come on, servitors. Silver now, Spear Gun is from Predator 2. He doesn't use it that often, but... What about the... What about the, the thing that from... from um, Dude, I wish so bad that AVP? The, the little... The three balls? The, the electric scanner laser thingies? Uh, you mean that made He's, a... Do you mean do you mean uh, the second one Requiem or do you mean the first? You're in Requiem, yeah. Where he you mean those ones that made a laser grid? The laser grid. He pushes you towards yeah. it. Yeah, that was hype. One thing I will give the AVP movies is that they came up with some cool weaponry. Like you really don't need more. Like you've got yeah. enough. But that, that was pretty cool. Well, again, the idea being like back on the whole planet of. That this is also that's also cool. Like oh. Like, oh, 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 oh. Oh, deal with it. Yeah. Hey, it's Blondie Dread. As my favorite line of uh, of uh, Bad Boys 2. Go get Blondie Dread. Blondie Dread's in the pink house. <laughs> oh, he found me. I want Guan, Blondie Dread Man. <laughs> Blondie Dread Man, exactly. Blood Star. <laughs> Did send for the man down the road, you see. <laughs> Una fest for my walk. I brought the put in the cocky jungle. Fucking shit, man. <laughs> Blood cleating on your mouth. <laughs> That's fucking creepy, Sally. <laughs> Telling you, dude. Tapping in. Tapping into the childhood. Hey, how's was Scorpion God do it? <laughs> Scorpion God good. We I don't mean, worship the Scorpion God, you see. Oh. <laughs> Scorpion. Scorpion God and Jamaican party, you know. <laughs> You, you give the scorpion god, like, an offering of Jamaican patties and, like, Bob Marley, Bob Marley vinyls. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, oh, my chest. Dude, scorpion with a giant red, green, and gold dread hat. <laughs> All right, people, get to drive. You want to see the fans? Gentlemen, start your Photoshops. <laughs> so an offering of Jamaican uh, patties and Bob Marley vinyls. Just fucking... Just the chillest... Oh, my God, they didn't notice that shit. Most fiery scorpion god ever. Well, I'll worship him. Yeah. This is okay. <laughs> Pretty, pretty relaxing. I can't believe he's, he's aiming at the plank that's in front of him. Whatever. No, oh, dude. God, that's like just the way the legs hang is yeah, just like what? It's, it's it's a thing. God. Here comes you. Oh my God. Uh, it's basically Baron Sam. No, it's Baron Sam. It's Papa Shango. It's Papa Shango, who went on to be a pimp. 
Like if you if like, you are a hooker, <laughs> and I know some of you out there must be. Uh huh. If you decide to go with a pimp whose previous occupation was voodoo death god, <laughs> you might want to look at your priorities a little more closely instead of not at all. Reconsider handing in that CV. Just saying. <laughs> uh, do I have firebombs? Those would be good. I have shitloads of firebombs. That is a good thing. Because God damn King Wooly over here. King Willy. King Wooly. You know what? Fine. I can't even fight it. You shouldn't. Embrace. I love the, the subtle rap being played right now. So he's really having the time yeah. of trying to figure out where the fuck I am. Oh, wow. he's, he's got shit. Just chucking them grenades. He, he, uh, he leveled up in Jamaica. And <laughs> Down in Montego Bay. At the Predator fucking training center. <laughs> that sounds really official. Bloody dread man. Oh, yeed. Go to the things, idiot. Can you, like, sacrifice anyone randomly? Like, can you just beat him up, grab him, and walk towards no, the not, point? No, 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 boss. I like that. Like that. Um, Gotta love this urban sounding music. Truly setting the tone. The tone. The proper tone. The undercurrents. <laughs> Fucking idiot. Jesus You're walking the other one. Is that a mine or. Okay, well, like. Okay, well, it is a mine, but they're I mean. They're fire bombs, is what they're called. Because they're, they're not doing much, dude. I know, but that's like. How wow. much? I'm not watching his energy bar. How how are they doing? It's it's doing like nothing. How are you fucking struggling with some random fucking some random dude with like a spear and a loincloth is owning you? I assume he's gonna retaliate after. Oh yeah, I wonder. Whoa! Oh. It's a fucking. Jeez. It's a scorpion god it's, shit. It's, uh, it's like Vice and Mature and Rugal oh from my god, King of totally Fighters. Right. Giant energy explosion into a skull. <sighs> With a little bit of... Uh, whatchamacallit? Uh, uh, um, dude from Mortal Kombat. Bald guy. Uh, Quan Chi. Quan. Quan Chi. Alright, I think like maybe two or three more. I did appreciate the reveal that Quan Chi is the announcer. Yeah. He is the voice of, of Mortal Kombat. Well, uh, from four onwards. Before it was an older guy that was always that always played Shao Kahn. Yeah, yeah, yeah And then right. that actor, unfortunately, died because he's like an old guy. But Did he? Yeah. Oh, it, was, okay. it was sad because I always I preferred his voice. Eh, Quan Chi was fun. Top hat still in tow. <laughs> That's awesome. Top hat unlocked. <laughs> I want a friend over the top hat. Come on. That's right, people. In case there was any doubt, I am the alpha killer. A super you're, predator. You're all just beta. Look at how fucking beta you are. You're all pre-beta? <laughs> pre-beta would be alpha. Um, I that watched, guy over there, he's a release candidate. I watched a video of um, fucking Dead Island Riptide, the Dead Island sequel. Why would you do this? Uh, because I, I because I I'm not going to say who, but a company wanted me to do a video on it, and I kindly disagreed. I and, can't believe you've done this. Uh, and it says pre-alpha footage all over the footage, and it's nine minutes of completely bug-free gameplay. And one of the things that Pat agreed with me is that, like, any company ever will put pre-alpha over oh everything. God. Oh, my God. Because it's... Dude, of course. But Because it's... Well, people We, we go, know this. We've yeah, been know, there. We've but seen some it. people that are aware, you bump your friend and go, dude, that game looks so hype, and it's only pre-alpha. Yeah, 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 and, yeah. and the person will be like, what the hell does pre-alpha mean? 
It's like, we haven't even started doing shit yet. Look how great it already looks. You're not even ready. It's, it's, it's like the final beta. All right, so this is the other made-up gang. Like, the Jamaicans and the Mexicans or Colombians or whatever. Sorry. It's the fucking junkies. The, these are the, uh, the kids of death who are like, death is everywhere, man. And uh, they take these drugs that make them feel nothing. Of course. Because you want to feel nothing all the time. And you see how sketched they are. So, I can't believe she doesn't know that that guy's behind her. Uh, it was a fucking ICP member. So this really just is Gotham City Market in the future. Market Prometheus Weapon Tech. That's fucked up now. Oh, the, the, the gang's yeah. called the Dead Men. Yeah. No, it's totally, um, um, uh, whatchamacallit. Uh, Jeff Hardy's cult. It's Dark Knight Returns Gotham, where you have the mutants... And all those, yeah. and all the gangs fighting for, rivaling for supremacy. Remember in Judge Dredd? But they, they, also, I was about to say, but also Judge Dredd. Exactly. Remember in Judge Dredd how they went through the gang list really quickly, like the latest movie, and they said the judged. And it's people that painted their faces the, the, to look the, like yeah. judge, judges. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the top it's of like, their head. I don't understand, like but that sounds awesome. That's fucking cool, yeah. Uh, so if I recall, I need to collect, like, three little beacons and just set them up. This part's easy, but... Uh, you also don't want to be seen during this part, so I gotta stick to the shit. And why is she still still talking? What's she saying? I don't even understand having a narrator in this. What? Okay, you have to literally. You can't be seen at all during the section. Yeah. I really hate her voice. It's, it sounds like a Viridian Dynamics no, lady. I, well, I know what they're going for. Yeah, they're going for that, that kind Detached, of... Detached, like... like a, a cyborg or, or like um, uh, future dystopian future voice, computer voice. I know that. But it's, she sounds really bad. you know really what the voice, how to do that is? Is Eliza Kassan in Deus Ex. That's how you do that voice. Because hmm. A, Eliza Kassan is super hot. And B, she's a super cool hologram. It's like hotter than Jim. And you and you and you'd say, Matt, you're crazy. Matt, no one you're could be, crazy. No one could be hotter than Jem. And I'm like, I thought that too. <laughs> <laughs> but it turns out I was uh, like, Jem is in like Jem and the holograms. Jem and the holograms, really. Jem, Jem is excitement. You know, a really popular animated GIF to show displeasure at something is this picture of Jem's boyfriend walking off. And he kind of kicks really violently, and he hits over a plant, and it slowly falls down. And then Jem turns to the camera and starts crying. <laughs> it's fucking awesome. All I gotta say is Misfits for life. Misfits can't even read. Yeah! I nailed it. What a champ. And now you are so not And now stuck. I accidentally pressed the X button, so now I'm healing. <laughs> Why don't I, uh... Can you even? Restart the level there. You need to... <laughs> Like predator. You really need to predator, start you told, No, no, but it's like Predator. You must remain stealth until the time is fit to strike. Oh, oh, oh. I'm just going to jump in the water now and respawn on the fucking shore. And do what you just like fucking kill it. Okay, well, I shouldn't have... Now we know that we should just... Okay, thank God. Did you press the white button? I, I just pressed... That's, I just hammered all the face buttons. Yeah. It's not happening now, though. The devil's clan. God, it's so it's so hacky to just have a pentagram as like your gang symbol. Yeah. It's like, what are you fucking hot topic? Like, Jesus, bunch of fucking goth kids. I want to say you nailed it by saying <laughs> by saying hot topic. Right. We are the cult of Jonan Vasquez. <laughs> we worship our god, Johnny the homicidal maniac. Question sleep. Our Dark Lord is Emily, <laughs> the strangest of all. Like, okay. Just re really? Really? Yeah? Yeah? Okay. Can you do... Move well. Or die. Can you do, like... You, clearly you haven't done okay, any... Okay, I did it. You, no, but you've done no cool rooftop kills, so I don't, I'm assuming you don't have any. Uh, I think it's something I gotta, like, earn or whatever. Because, like, post-Assassin's Creed world... If you walk up to a rooftop and you look down at an enemy and you can't do a sick ass jumping kill, just fuck it. Fuck everything. Turn the game off. You're done. Alright. <laughs> there it is again. Oh, there it is. Cool. <laughs> hey, man. It's a tough world for women. <laughs> 
It's a because I watched Seven Psychopaths again, and when Christopher Walken oh, is talking God, about yes. how bad his script is, yeah. he goes, "All you women characters are terrible." Terri- and he's like, "What's wrong with them?" He's like, "They're all stupid idiots, and each of them get killed within five minutes." What are you trying to say? And he goes, uh, "It's a tough world for women." <laughs> yeah, it's a tough world for women, but I know a few women that can string a sentence together. <laughs> he's, and he's starting to laugh at that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, like, uh, so I need another thingy. Chris Walken, like, is just a parody of himself at this point. Like, all huge A-list actors. Right, right, right. But his delivery in that movie is great. Like, literally, but, but it's like, yeah, Chris Walken and, and Jack Nicholson and, you know, all these dudes, they just get so, um, um... Butter. Uh, no. <laughs> uh, 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 Morgan Freeman. Like, you hit, yeah. you're so popular after a point... That you're just pa- a parody of I'm what pl- you are. I'm playing Morgan Freeman. You're acting like yourself, exactly. I'm playing Morgan Freeman, playing God. Or a president, whatever. Or or the head of the wanted gangs, gang corporation, or whatever. Sure, uh, yeah, the wanted gangs. I forget his name. Uh, the character's name, rather. Now shoot this motherfucker! Can't believe you haven't shot this motherfucker yet. <laughs> What am I paying you for? For not shooting motherfuckers? I don't think so. So you forgot the name of it, and I'm glad you did, because everyone needs to forget everything about that movie, so that maybe one day, a movie based on the comic book version, which is That'll never infinitely happen because, superior. Because as we know, Mark Millar is busy making every other thing he ever created into a movie as well. Yes! So, you know what? He's not maybe gonna go he, back. He'll cycle around. Maybe he'll cycle around. Dude, I've been reading for years, ever since one came out, that they're trying to think Think of a way to make Wanted Two, but bring Angelina Jolie and Morgan Freeman back, even though they both died. Are you serious? Yeah, the, the, that's like if not for that, a Wanted movie oh would have been God. out a long time ago. Fuck everything, right? You read Wanted, right? Yeah, you gave it to me actually. It's so good. Everyone out there, if you like Wanted, first of all, fuck you. The movie. S- the movie. Thank you. Second, fuck you. And third, go read the comic. You know my personal favorite story of failure is? Is uh, when they, when the, uh, the, 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 uh, the apple of the eye of the game industry for that one year, Grin, oh. made Wanted Weapons of Fate, which is probably one of the worst, but not, I wouldn't say one of the worst, uh, one of the most generic, yeah. why would you even play yeah. this? of third person shooters ever yeah I would know I worked on it you I forgot that you did I, I forgot worked that on you it. did and yes the one thing the one glimmer of a hope was that they bring the suit back and Wesley yes. actually has the suit from the comic yeah, yeah and you're like oh my god maybe they're gonna do a th- no uh, but, but what if they no bullet bending for for everybody but my story is gonna be that how uh, on game trailers the producer of that wanted game was like Wanted's gonna sell three million copies, and you know what's trash? Anyone that's spending money on Wii games, you're just like, did you know? I know the budget for Mad World. They need to sell five million copies to make a profit. And everyone's <laughs> like, what the fuck are you talking uh, about? And why would you know what Sega and Platinum, two Japanese and companies, other companies, yeah, and then 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 Wanted completely bombs, and Grin shuts down the next three months later, and everyone was like, okay, it's such a fucking idiot. Oh, man, what a time. All right. All units, all units, we have an ambulance being raided for drugs in Orsini Green. Be advised, this is not a... Now, if I recall, I need to get these drugs back before they make all their destinations. Now, if I recall, you need to get all the drugs and take them before anybody else can. You literally have to do this. Like, why do you gotta do this? What does this do? Inject all the drugs into yourself. That way no one can ever Are use them again. Are people holding boxes? No, they're not. Okay, I gotta find these white things on my mini-map, I guess. Ah, so, shit. Wait, so, so are you allowed to be exposed now? Now, yeah. I mean, it's not exactly Jesus. a good thing, but... Dudes are fucking pulling on Halo weapons on you. Like needlers and shit. Yeah. <laughs> You're just saying that because it looks like it's got a bunch of needles on it? Because it's like purple shots coming yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I remember in Punisher 2099, they had this, like, because in 2099, it's like, whatever, we can make whatever stupid tech that doesn't exist. Who's going to stop us? It's 2099, right? 
2029 technology who's gonna stop us who yeah oh fuck she's not a bad guy yeah she is she's holding the drugs one of four killed oh she's totally a bad guy um one of the weapons in Punisher 29 is the needle gun which it shoots a slow, small projectile that buries itself into your under your skin. In, in and weapons burrows, in, in what? In what? In Punisher twenty nine nine, it burrows your way its way under your skin and to your heart, where it make your heart explode. But it does it in about sixty seconds, so you have the opportunity to slash it out, and most what? people can't. So what you basically do is shoot it at a person and not worry about them, because. They're either gonna have to spend time slashing Wait, well, that out of them. Sorry, you mean you mean in the comic, right? There was no like game or anything. No, no, no. I, I, that game would have been cool, but no, yeah, it's it's. Uh, okay, okay, just something that he does in the comic. So like, it's not Frank Castle, but uh, Jake Gallows. He gets to be like Ken Shiro, basically on basically. dudes. You have sixty seconds to live. Consider your sins as at this time. You're so gonna die, dude. You don't even know. I, I, like, I'm Roses are red, violets are blue. Oh my, wamo, shinde iru. That was great. Don't act like you're not impressed, <laughs> drug lady. She loved it. Is she dead? Not even. Man, drug bitches. She's like, oh, what a high. <laughs> oh. I gotta haul ass to Lollapalooza. Where'd he go? Mission failed? When? Oh. Fishing mailed. This better come out from when the drugs are captured. <sighs> Avoid. If it's water. not, we're calling it. If we had to start over, then, you know. Well. Oh my god. We'll see you for the next part, everybody. Game's not great, but you wanted it. Fuck you, Matt. We could have played Persona, but no, you all Fuck said you. you all said Predator Concrete Jungle. Uh, I don't know when the next parts are gonna be uploaded because I don't I don't care. Uh, Bye!